Yo, what's up guys, it's Lightings and welcome back to another Cold War Zombies video. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you all currently working glitches in the map Maldair Totem. Also did a previous video on all working glitches in D Machine. If you want to go check that video out, the link will be down in the description below. Let's get right on to it. So for our first glitch, all you want to do is just make your way over to the West Berlin Street. All you want to do is just jump on the corner of this tank right here next to the little yellow radio. And then all you want to do is just pull back. As you guys can see, once you've done the glitch correctly, all zombies will pile up right below you. I recommend this glitch specifically for weapon XP and camos as it's really effective and easy to do. And it's really easy to get critical kills as basically every shot is a headshot. Another tip for this glitch is... I recommend you guys saving one zombie at the end of the round. For our next glitch, this is literally right next to the tank where you did the first glitch. All you want to do is just raffle onto the blasted suit. Now you just want to go right here. You just want to take a straight jump and mantle. And then you should land in this like little piece of debris. All you want to do is just go exactly where I do it and crouch down. So that no zombies will be able to throw meat at you. Some zombies do also pile up, but I recommend you guys using crossbar so you can kill the full horde of zombies. In this next glitch, all you want to do is just make your way over to the Cobra rooftop. And you just want to jump on this air vent and pull back a little bit. Like in the first glitch, all zombies will pile up right below you. Makes it really easy to get critical kills as basically every shot is a headshot. I recommend this glitch to get your XP camos and stuff like that really fast. So for our next glitch, this is in the destroyed penthouse. All you want to do is just make your way over to these sandbags, take a strafe jump on top of the zip line, and all you want to do is just mantle over this invisible barrier and you just want to fall exactly where I do and push on your stick so that you fall on this little platform right here. All zombies will pile up right in front of you and they will throw meat at you after a while, that's why you just want to move a little bit left or right so you don't get hit. Um, if you do go too left or too right, you could also fall out of this glitch. The good thing about this glitch is that the bosses will also pile up. Before I start this glitch, I want to let you guys know that you can't use any sort of healing items whilst doing this glitch. So you can't use healing aura, stim shots, or self revive. For this glitch, you'll need stamina up, juggernog, and frenzied guard only. So for this glitch, all you want to do is just firstly make your way over to the destroyed penthouse and turn on the power so you could get all your perks and stuff like that, like I said in the intro. Once you've done that, all you want to do is just go on these sandbags, take a strafe jump on top of this zip line, and you just want to jump on this balcony right here. You just want to follow the exact same path I take, guys, as you guys can see. Once you fall right here, you just want to make your way over to the concrete wall where you just want to stay here so you could regen your health. Now you just want to jump over this little barrier right here, and you just want to find this little hole and you just want to stay right here so you could reach on your health again. Now you just want to jump right over here and you just want to follow the exact same path I do. Right around this corner and you also want to pay attention to your health as right when you reach 46 you want to turn on frenzy guard. Now you just want to keep running until you reach these fences right here and you just want to turn right. Now you just want to go right here and just jump into the hotel window. Then just crawl right here as you guys can see until you reach this little place where you will just want to fall exactly where I do into the glitch spot. Now you just want to walk through this wall and now you're officially under the map. All zombies will pile up right below you as you guys can see and if you go on this little platform on your left and crawl underneath the stairs you will not be able to get teleported and all zombies including the bosses like the manglers, panzers and disciples won't be able to hit you so you're basically in god mode. This glitch is really good overall and it's probably the best glitch currently working in season 5 cold war zombies so make sure to make the most of it before it does get patched. In this glitch you could also pick up like all the power ups and as well if you do have mule kick you'll be able to pick up the ammo that the zombies do drop. Now. You basically have unlimited ammo in this glitch and it's really good you could just stay here until you reach the high rounds. All zombies including panzers, manglers and the disciples will pile up. If you do ever need to get out of this glitch all you want to do is just go back where you um, enter this glitch and just jump right here. 
burn last glitch all you want to do is do the spawn skip glitch so jumping on these sandbags taking a strafe jump on top of this zip line and mental now all you want to do is just fall exactly where i do and you just want to quickly revive yourself and open this door to stop taking damage once you've done that all you want to do is just find the tempest and kill it so you could pick up the electrical fuse just be aware of death barriers as they can kill you Now once you've got the first electrical fuse, you just want to get the second electrical fuse and turn on the power. Once you've turned on the power, you could return back to the East Berlin Street and pack up onto your weapons, stuff like that. Now once you've done that, all you want to do is just return to the East Berlin Street. And all you want to do is just jump on this piece of debris exactly where I do. All zombies will literally just ignore you. And yeah, it's a really good glitch overall to get XP and camos. And it's basically a semi god mode glitch all you have to worry about are the bosses that could be easily countered with a wonder weapon pack a punch or ring of fire so those are all the glitches for today's video i hope you enjoyed make sure to leave a like subscribe turn on notifications so you never miss a video and make sure to check out my previous video where i showed you guys all the working glitches in d machine link will be down in the description below